Why? You are one of the sane ones, are you not? I am Selen of the West. I seek my brother, Garl Vinland. Well, I see you made it out. Yeah, I, I made it out safely too. I have my pyromancy of the Great Swamp, so I can use your manage with a bit of care. Uh, oh, uh, hello there. W welcome to my uh, shop. I'm Morlin, and I, well, I sell armor. Oh, prithee, art thou good yours, master? I am Yuria of Londor, a close friend of his. Thanks to thee, your soul is redeemed. That swordsmanship, it was a thing to behold. Few have managed to kill me in such a thorough manner. Bail! Vile Bail! Oh! Terror incarnate! There is life in me yet! Mark my words! You too shall know fear! Elden Ring DLC. Oh, it's here. It's finally here. The greatest game ever comes back again with quite possibly the best DLC expansion since the uh, the Oblivion horse armor. And man, I can't wait to jump back into Elden Ring and just die and die and die and die. And die. It's going to be great. So I got a lot of footage from playing the DLC and while yes, there are bosses with bullshit hitboxes and movesets and maybe the lore can get a little obtuse, but this is one of the best times I've had with an expansion since the old Hunter's DLC in Bloodborne. I mean, this DLC is basically like Bloodborne. Born 2.0. The shit in here will give you nightmares. Either way, hope you enjoy this playthrough, and if you want more Souls content, I'll be happy to oblige. By the way, the audio is kind of trash because I don't know how audio works still, so sorry if some parts sound a bit off. I'll do my best not to blow out anyone's ears. I can't say the same for Egon, though. <laughs> Let's start. I am so excited, holy sh I've been hearing so many things about this DLC that it is one of the best gaming experiences ever, and I just am feeling like a giddy little fanboy who needs to just get into Elden Wing. Elden Wing! By the way, this load time is pretty fucked, alright? It's already been like two minutes. Um, so here we have my character. I changed him. It's a uh, Regan Arataka. I've only seen half of the first season, but I already- I just loved Regan's character, and I just wanted to- you know, caused by him. I'm coming. I'm coming, Mikola. I'm coming to save you from the Mo Glester. <laughs> Who the hell are you? Ah, were you guided here by kindly Mikola? Nope. Touch the withered arm, and you too will be transported to the realm of shadow where Mikola the Kind now dwells. Uh, sure. Yeah, why not? I'll do it. it looks like you're going to the shadow realm, Jimbo. Oh, is that it? That. That's all it takes to get into the DLC. I was, uh, not gonna lie, I was half expecting Mikola, like, the withered arm to just drag me into the cocoon. <whistles> Look at where we are. God damn. Okay, Torrent, let's go. Oh, what the? Hello? Oh, you're a freaky one. Damn. Oh my god, my damage. <laughs> yeah, baby. Woo! I'm so glad I'm so high level. Level 696. Do you, do you think I'm high enough? Yeah, I should be good. Allow us to introduce ourselves. Uh, okay, okay. Oh, come on. Oh, hey, Berserk reference. <gasps> worms! It's the worms! And of course, bird enemies uh, can't have enough of those, fuckers. Look at me! Oh, no, 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 Okay, 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 oh, whoa, 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 okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. Fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> oh, come on. You know, I really shouldn't be playing on New Game Plus 3. I feel bad for anyone that's playing on New Game Plus 7. That must be, uh, wow, that must be a bitch to deal with. All right, let's try this again. Hey, you caught me. Oh, come on. Ah, you fucking, uh, infinite poise bastard. Okay, I'm out of here. Score one for 
for the boys back home. Uh, oh my god, can these birds leave me alone? I'm gonna fight something a lot easier. Ah! See, can you even kill this thing? Can you, is it even possible to kill this thing? What the fuck? What is this? Hello. Oh, well, that's great. That's perfect damage. That's, oh, that's fun. Ah! Oh, no. Oh, well, it was fun while it lasted. Oh, you know, you can't do this. You were gonna try and flash me. Let's see how you like it. How? How am I still alive? There we go. And goodbye. Hell yeah. Deflecting hard tier and furnace visage. What are those things supposed to do? Man, nah, whatever. I killed it! Alright, um, who are you? Mikala. 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 Ah! You must be the tarnished. I am Ansbach. Formerly in service to Lord Moog. But now, like you, another soul guided by kindly Mikola. God, enough of this I'm kindly Mikola shit. I already know he's the bad was. guy. I'm just, I'm just waiting until I can, uh, you know, get to kill him. Guy. Why is it always Fortnite? <laughs> Hello. What the fuck? No! 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 Is this not the Shadow Realm room? Shadow Realm. Uh oh. Keep your legs straight when you hit the water. Motherfucker. I need more bullets. I need more bullets. Bigger weapons. Bigger weapons. I need more bullets. And here we are, everybody. We're in the back streets of Detroit. As you can see, we're uh, getting along with the locals just fine. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Those stripped of the grace of gold shall all meet death in the embrace of Mesmer's flame. What? Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> all right. Hey, okay. Just wait until the mods get updated, you stupid bull cutted fuck. Suck my dick. Oh my god, guys, I love Dark Souls 2! Are you fucking with me? Are you fucking with me? Graceless heathen. <sighs> Thou shalt not evade the flame of my Yeah, sure. Sure I won't. Praise the message and then try door. Cool, fuck you. <laughs> no 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 no, you're you're a lot to deal with. That's right! Oh no, no you're still alive, okay. Those things are freaky deaky! Hello! <laughs> Red main Freja. And listen, don't bash me for using summons and mimic, okay? Even Miyazaki does it. Excuse me! Now here's the question, are you as strong as Ludwig? Okay. <laughs> Weird ass camera tracking on this one, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. Corner, corner, I'm in the corner! Ah! 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 Okay, we don't probably. <gasps> yeah, mimic! <laughs> it's, it's so, so freaking huge. Ah, oh, it's awesome. Hell yeah, I'm taking that. Hell yeah, second try. I know I used a summon, but who cares? That was sick as hell. Found my first DLC dungeon. Whoa! Okay, now this is a very well-looking dungeon. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Stupid. Try crouching and then there will be dung. Still no Fortnite. Okay, I get it, I get it. Oh, hell no! Oh, please, not the jar. Anything but that. I promise I won't ever do it again. I swear, a living saint, I'll surely be. Please, you must forgive me. Forgive me, please! Shadowed Realm Ring. What the fuck is that? Holy! Oh my God! No! No! Oh, yo! Oh! 
big bastard! That was one of the grossest and creepiest enemies I've seen so far. That just looks like an amalgamation of meat and people inside of a jar. And I... <laughs> oh, oh, the lore for this DLC must be nasty. Ah, oh, the big blobs of meat. Just big old sacks of meat. I thought it was gonna be a boss or something. Not these things! <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. Oh, no! I'm alive. What's the what's the lore implications of this? This is just a it's a storage facility. Conglomerates of people put into jars. Oh, I'm the type of guy who likes to roam around. I'm never in one place. I'll roam from town to town. We're all good. <laughs> I just saw someone fall to their death. Great jar. <gasps> wait a second. Oh, wait a minute. You get away from me, you motherfucker. I'm trying to enjoy my great jar. Yes. Yes. Big jar. Look, everybody. It's me. Let me solo her. Now in a now in bigger fashion. Oh! That just came right at my face. By the way, I found a really dope weapon. It's the uh, Grey Katana, and it automatically comes with the Ichimonji. Ichimonji! Ah! Oh, I'm, I'm distracted. Yes, I know. Oh, okay. What the fuck are you? You're a... What the fuck? Come on, invisible, invisible walls. Silver, silver, silver. There's gotta be walls. There's gotta be invisible walls somewhere. There's gotta be somewhere. I wouldn't say it couldn't hurt to try and find an invisible wall, but apparently it does kind of hurt. But I'll take my chances. I'll take my chances down here. Oh, 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 on the brink. Oh, on the brink. Death Knight. Just straight up Death Knight. Whoa! He's fast. <laughs> Die. Okay, let me try to do that with a full, you know, set of flasks this time. Holy shit! He just showed up right in front of me. Face my mimic tier. He's right there. Oh my god! What type of anime attack was that? Okay, second boss down. That was alright. That was alright. Oh, what the... Whoa! That's cool, though. That is freaking sweet. Hello? Be wary of pathetic sort. Likely out of stamina. Bail! Vile Bail! Incarnate! <laughs> there is life in me yet! I will soon feast upon your heart! Mark my words! You too shall know fear! <laughs> the fuck? Are you good? First off, stay calm. <laughs> ancient dragon man. Go away! Go away, ancient dragon asshole! Go away! <laughs> what the hell is over here? What the hell is over here? Somebody tell me what is over here. I need some guidance. Oh Jesus, man! This is, this is really bad. This is really bad. This, we got a lot of skelly, skelly bros here. It's pretty bad here. You know what I'm saying? Oh! Magma Worm! Ah, uh, well, wouldn't be a FromSoft DLC if it didn't have at least one repeated enemy or boss fight. Okay, so, uh, this is kind of embarrassing. I didn't know I was supposed to jump down, like, this hole right here to go to the boss fight and then head to Jagged Peak. So I kind of just left the cave and went to go fight the Black Jail Knight again because I really just wanted to beat him. So I, I came back to this later, but, yeah, I just- I kind of pulled a stupid and forgot about the boss fight in this cave. But, yeah, we'll come back to this later. Anyways, let's kill this Walking Guts reference. Oh god, still does high damage, but uh, not, not too much now since I got some fragments. It's good, it's good, we're still alive, we're still alive here. God, I did not nearly have enough fragments for this fight. Yes! <laughs> oh, oh yes. That is what I wanted from the very beginning. 
Thank you for your service. Ooh, that's smooth. That's a that's a cool great sword. I'm probably not gonna use it though. Milady, Jesus Christ! I get it! I get it! You're a dog! Fuck! Love ambience. Perfect for the weekend. I hate dogs! I hate dogs! I hate everything about you. Why do I love you? Wait, what the fuck did that just say? I want to go home and then edge. <laughs> I want to go home and then edge. Okay. Needle Knight Lita. Do you have to tell me twice? This is... This is probably gonna be a fucked up boss. Oh, good lordy, okay. What the fuck, Pontiff Sullivan? Close enough, welcome back, Dark Souls 3. Get him up, let him get up, let him get up, let him get up. Fight back, nigga! <laughs> what, you think I'm not clever enough? Second try, baby. That that was cool. It was like a Pontiff Sullivan variant. Oh, that was that was pretty easy. I mean, I I, I did have the summons, but but you you did actually beat the boss. You have to do it with both of the level one that you rolled with your fist. You practically cheated your way through the game. You little bit. Skadoosh. Ooh, Atlas. Oh. Okay, so this is further beyond map. Oh, 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 Size of limb grave my ass. You're a fucking liar, Michael Zaki. Try bow and try trap. Like, do they mean set up a trap? I, I, I really don't know what they're going on about, but I'll bring out the bow. The fuck? Come on. Oh god. <laughs> oh god, that is so funny! That is so funny! <gasps> and if I stand here. Hey! Hey, come here! I'm coming! <laughs> <laughs> Stupid. Stupid motherfucker. Hell yeah, this game is mine. Okay, okay. Oh, come on! Hey, so I did some exploring on my own, got some new drip, and I, uh, I don't know, what do y'all think? I, I think I look pretty damn cool with what I got on right now. So yeah, DLC is going well so far, but I think there was something I forgot to do. Oh yeah, the bail shed, whatever that is. Hey, uh, so you guys are familiar with those really bad looking mobile game ads, right? The Mafia boss ones and all that such. Or maybe the ones that have obvious fake gameplay, trying to make it look cooler than it actually is. Well, I came across one of the worst mobile game ads I've possibly have ever seen, and you probably already saw it, but if you haven't, behold. Alas, I am returned. Oh wow, this game looks so good. I can't wait to play, uh, Ancient Seal, The Exorcist. God, the people who are making these ads just don't care anymore. It's honestly astounding how bad this is. Like, the more you watch it, the worse it gets because you start to notice everything that is wrong with this ad. First off, Elden Ring. This is literally Elden Ring gameplay. Nowhere do I see original gameplay that alludes to a game where you're exercising ghosts or some crap. Second, the gameplay. It's literally using the Karian Combo Warriors mod in Elden Ring to try and make it look like fake gameplay for the ad. This does not look like exercising in the slightest. Thirdly, the badly placed UI to give the illusion of controlling the character. You can't even see it because it's covered up by YouTube's UI as well. And the best part, this isn't even a video that they made, it's an edit that they ripped straight from TikTok. Of course, to sprinkle in more shit on this cake of lies, you have the rumbling in the background. <laughs> It's beautiful, really. The people making these apps don't even care to make ads that promote the game anymore. They just make them only to confuse you by editing the ad with random gameplay you know isn't actually a part of the game that is being promoted. So you click on the link, see the crappy mobile game, and then most likely have your information stolen because you clicked on a phishing link. 
It's all shock value for clicks at this point. The dumb ads are the only entertaining part of this whole thing. I even found an ad that just straight up ripped off Ghost of Tsushima gameplay. Fake AI voice and UI and everything. I was looking for this game more than a month ago, I think. This is the most comfortable game I have ever played. Wait, I, I just realized this is made by the same company, the Ancient Seal shit. What the fuck? I'm really curious if the people who commissioned these ads got any money from this, or if they got sued from the companies for taking their gameplay. Man, I don't really care anymore. Let's go back to Shadow of the Earth Tree. Bail! Vile bail! Oh, Bile. Hey, you guys remember that cave where I found the giant jar helmet? Turns out there was a boss here that I forgot to fight, so let's just fix that real quick. Ha! Die. Ow. Scum. Okay. Okay, Virgil. Holy. He even has Judgment's Cuts and he really is a Virgil variant. Hey, new NPC. Hey, dude. What a very intelligent conversation. Beast Claw for the win! Be brave, show no fear. You could have just said, uh, jump, you won't die. Just like freaking Slave Knight Gale back in Dark Souls 3. Ancient Dragon Man. Okay. Really loving these names. Good night. What can be over here? Oh, it's a gray side. Oh my god, it's a gray side. No map ahead, therefore seek river. I can't believe this is what I missed. This is where I was trying to go the whole time. Bailey? Why well, can't read? Oh, terror incarnate. Again, I stand afore ye. Who the hell is Bailey? Bailey? I guess I wasn't paying attention the first time I ran into him. I basically pronounced Bail as Bailey up until I run into Egon again. So I'm just gonna be pronouncing Bail in various ways until I get it right. <laughs> kind of just look like the, the first dragon I fought in the beginning of the game. Probably got something. A drake is not supposed to conjure lightning. Oh my god, I just recognized that's a whole ass dragon. That is just a dragon right there. Warrior Troop. yourself. Feasting upon a Ooh, okay. Pests. We fought an ancient dragon man, so it only makes sense to run into an ancient dragon woman. How you doing, beautiful? You having a good time? Devour Draconic Essence? Ah, fuck it, why not? Probably tastes pretty good. Now, seek the jagged peak. There you will find Bay. Bay! I will grant you the strength required. In the name of my lord, Placidus Uh, okay. Uh, sure. Ancient Dragon's Blessing. So it's pronounced Placidusax. I thought it was pronounced Placidusix. Uh, I just looked up on where to find Bailey. Bay. Bay! God, I love how non-linear this DLC is. It is like... Like, just go at your pace. Do what you want. Go where you go. You're gonna find some things, and you're gonna enjoy your time. Where am I going? Who is this Bailey creature? I don't know what the heck I'm getting into, but it's definitely gonna- It's gonna be something mean. It's gonna be something mean if there's just two random dragons here covering the entrance. Another one? Huh? The hell are y'all even fighting right now? Nature documentary activated. As we can see, the vile drake is here killing another drake. What a beautiful sight to behold in the lines between. Have you seen anything more beautiful than this? This is so cool, dude. This is, can't believe you just get to witness this in game. I was playing Dragon's Dogma 2 and I was enamored by the fact you could run into this, but now it, this is just all over um, Shadow of the Earth Tree. All right, nice fight, dude. All right, catch you later. I'll do this fight another time. I'm not trying to find another Drake. Ancient Dragon Sensiex. How many, how many dragons are up here, bro? I'm just trying to find Bailey. I don't have a problem with you. And what is this? What, what am I going up against? All right, Bailey, Bailey. where are you? Map, oh map. I will get that map. I swear. I've never gone this far of a walk for a boss, and. I don't think I've ever played a boss that had this much of a buildup. Oh shit. We're already here. First off, give up. Warrior ahead. Beating to a pulp. Oh, beating to a pulp. Hello? Anyone? <laughs> Hello! I'm hungry! Goodbye! <laughs> Well, that was that was fast. That was a record grab it. 
Oh my god. Alright, well, let's fucking go. Hey, come on. I'm trying to trying to get the upper hand here. I Bro! I, I can't even get a hit in. You're fucking crazy looking! Whoa! Damn it! I oh that's so fast! That attack is so freaking fast! Hey! <laughs> Watch, he's gonna give me red. No! Yep, I knew it. I fucking knew it. Close enough. Welcome back, Dark Eater Madeer. Are you. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm okay. Don't sleep on the family, Cody. No! Just, okay. What the. Fuck this. Fuck this. Fuck you. Suck my fucking I. Dude, this. People were struggling with the lion. People were struggling with Relana, the fight, um, the whatever moon boss fight, the thingy with the two swords. Pontiff Sullivan cosplayer. No. No. Bailey. One hour later. Ah! Fucking. <laughs> Maybe I should take a break from this. I will kill that dragon. I just need to get stronger. Cerulean Coast. I made it. Jesus, give it the From Software to hide some of the most beautiful looking areas ever in like a separate part of the map. Like this is completely optional. I don't think you have to touch this area at all if you want to complete the DLC. But it's just here for you to find. <gasps> it's a penguin! It's a penguin! This is the greatest game ever made. There probably was penguins already, but I kind of just forgot about them, gloss over them. Sealed and obscured by Mikola. Oh, okay. I, I remember this. Um, in the main game, you have to break this seal by collecting, like, great runes and shit, but, um, what do I do for this? Dancer of Rana. Oh, look at you. I think I saw you in the trailer. It's just like a human version of, like, um, the Dancer of the Boreal Valley from Dark Souls 3. All right, I'm back after a little break. I want to give the Bailey fight another try. Round two. Oh wow, look at that! I do so much damage. Why am I even doing this to myself? Ah. Okay, well, yep, I figured it. The music is so dope, though. Oh hey, look at that! Finally doing some damage. Uh oh. Oh my fucking god! Demon Prince as well! I knew I should have taken that left turn at Albuquerque. This is it! This is a dragon fight! Holy... Holy hell! No wonder why this area is called Jagged Peak. That boss fight is peak. Okay, but real question, how the fuck am I supposed to kill this guy? <laughs> what the fuck? He seems unkillable. <laughs> Alright, backhand blaze with bloodhound step. Can this work? Can this little build that I have right here work? Ah! <laughs> Bro, I got one hit in, and that was enough to piss you off? To bring in your- Sorry. <laughs> you- you brought your ultimate! Okay, so I it may seem like I'm getting pretty upset and angry that I can't kill this fucking dragon, but you know what? I, I'm unironically having a lot of fun because it's the first boss I've fought in a while that's giving me trouble. Ten minutes later! Shit! What the fuck? I couldn't even heal! I, I'm unironically having a lot of fun. Okay, that's it. I'm going to explore even more because this has been going on for too long. But the next time I come back, he is going to die. Last time a dragon boss fight gave me this much trouble is when I fought Madeir back in Dark Souls 3. But even then, I was able to read his attacks pretty well if you just lock onto the head. Locking onto the head in this fight just does not work. So you just gotta be careful with when you lock on and when you don't lock on. I just need to find more fragments and all that stuff and I think maybe I'll be good. Hell, I, I probably should have gone this way if I wanted to make it easier for myself, but I was just like, no, I refuse. I could have been at the final boss of the DLC right now if I wasn't trying to kill that dragon. Woo! Oh. Oh, it's just, it's just, it's just a grizzly bear. Those things are harmless. Golden hippopotamus! Look out, I think Motomoto like you. No! Oh, god damn it. No, not the hippo mouth. 
Nothing but the hippo mouth. There we go. Golden hippopotamus down. Oh wow, a uh, really cool grace placement. It reminds me of a uh, Dark Souls 3 with the Dragon Slayer armor bonfire. Like you beat the Dragon Slayer armor, you get the bonfire that spawns in the boss room since this is Dark Souls 3 after all. And immediately after, you walk a couple feet forward and you get another bonfire for the Grand Archives. Like what was the point of placing a bonfire after the fight in the boss room if the game is gonna give you one right after? I guess I forgot about that since we got two grace sites literally right next to each other in Shadow of the Earth Tree. Good job from software for keeping the spirit of Dark Souls alive. <laughs> Hello, hey. I am a Munchkins hey. man. Play nice. Hello, I am a Munchkins man. Play nice. I'm not getting near that. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Oh my god, I am. I hate these guys. I hate these guys with a burning passion. They do not amount to anything in this world. Hello, I am a, a Munchkins man. Are you? I can't fucking handle this shit anymore. If they wanted to bring back Dark Souls 2 style of enemy design, then you know what? Power to them. Okay, okay! Okay! Stuck in the corner! Motherfucker! Good job, From Software. You found a way to piss me off again. You're trying to fucking break me, but you're not gonna fucking break me. I'm the one who's gonna break the fucking game! Why do birds suddenly appear? Over there! Over here! Should I just delete my game off of my PC? Ha! That was... That was actually really freaking cool. Nothing personal, kid! Nope! <laughs> God, that is such a good ability. That is so such a good Ash of War. Oh! It's Alexander's cousin. Ancient ruins of Rao. Oh my god, the lighting. Oh my god, a new place to explore. Oh my god, look at it, it's so big, it's so huge. <laughs> you know who else? Hey, another Crucible Knight. But this guy's got a hammer. And it looks uh, pretty meaty and nasty. Ride like the wind, boy. What the hell? Dude, what? What? Yeah, I think I could kill him. Is he serious? Oh. You're a dick. I. Are you fucking serious? I jumped over that attack. Go fuck yourself. Okay, okay, I get it. You're fast as fuck. You're fast as fuck, boy! You're what? What? How? How? Yeah, I'm gonna use stealth on this guy. I can't fight him head on. Oh shit, I got bro stuck. Well, it was nice knowing ya. See ya, fucko. Hello there, fellow Drake warriors. So this dragon fight up at the top of the mountain has been giving me some trouble for the past two days, and I refuse to continue the main DLC story until I beat him. And I found out that other than the dragon Grey Katana, I also can summon the help from our trusty friend Egon. <laughs> I totally forgot about him this entire time because my hatred for this fucker just kept growing, but hey, I think it fits thematically for this since no one hates Bale more than Egon. Also, yes, I found out I was pronouncing Bale's name wrong this whole time, thinking it was pronounced Bailey. Yes, I know, I'm dumb as fuck, but come on, man, these fantasy names get harder and harder to pronounce every time. Like how Placidusax isn't pronounced Placidusax, I didn't find that out until I talked to the dragon lady. Placidusax. Fuck man, so many people still don't know that this word right here is pronounced jail. This right here is just the medieval version of spelling out the word jail. This is why I play and watch fantasy stories instead of writing them, because I don't know how to pronounce or say these words, let alone spell them. Anyways, let's go save Egon from the dragon puppies, yeah! Oh, Jesus. Yeah, no, Bale is fucked after this. It is I, Mason, the most legendary of Drake warriors. And I don't mean as in um, hunting Drake dragons. I mean hunting really insane Drake fans like Los Poyos. This could be anywhere in New Jersey. Wait, anywhere. hold on. Is this Cranford? Bro, we're in the middle of no fucking where. We better get going. What the fuck is that? Come on, we gotta get out of this neighborhood. I'm Where trying to get out! We're in the middle of fucking nowhere. Can I get a landmark? Anything? I think this shadow. is Milburn. Whoa, 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 whoa! Gotcha, bitch! <laughs> ah, I love this weapon. <laughs> See, even he's having a good time. What a sight. 
A warrior true, if ever one there was. Thank you, thank you very much. A fellow Drake warrior. Ah, I see you're a Kendrick fan as well. Do you not remember? Conjure your past. How once you were, when fear was yet foreign to you. <laughs> God, this guy is fucking cool. Drink warrior. Take this finger. My finger. Scale the jagged peak. Face bale the dread. And when you do, summon me. Summon my soul. My limbs are limbs no more. My heart is twice over filled with fear. But a Drake warrior, I remain. And my soul yet lies on the mountain. God, I'm actually so happy I uh, am avoiding the main DLC and I did this guy's quest line because I would have forgotten about his and most of the other quest lines in the game. So like, I'm glad I I, uh, I didn't kill Bale so that I could have finished his quest. You'll get your revenge, Egon, I swear. Also, I, uh, I can't see his summon sign, so uh, I'm gonna assume it's inside or something. Okay, let's fucking go. Round three. Fight. Hey, there he is! You <laughs> what? I hereby bow. You will rule <laughs> this day. Holy shit! Behold, a true great warrior, and I, Egon, your fears made flesh. <laughs> Holy shit! This guy is awesome. Oh my god, I am melting his health bar. Okay, yeah, I, I think I might beat him this time. Curse you, Bill! <laughs> you, my He's still going with this shit! But I will riddle with holes your rotten hide. With a hail of harpoons! Yeah! With every last drop of my being! Yeah! Okay, but I gotta watch out for the fireballs. Oh, oh my god, dude! Curse you, Bill! Yeah, get the fuck down, you fucking crippled lizard. Yeah! <laughs> I'ma let Egon finish him off. Let him get his revenge. You got this, you crazy crippled motherfucker! Yes! 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 We fucking did it! We did it! You shall haunt me no longer. Thank you, Egon, so much. I love it. The moment I got the Dragon Grey Katana and I got Egon and I learned how to pronounce Bale correctly, I beat the boss first try. God, that might have been the best boss fight I've ever played verbatim. No questions asked. 10 out of 10. Perfect. It's peak. Let's uh, see how Egon's doing after that fight. Oh, he's dead. No. Don't worry, Egon. I will wear your shit to commemorate you. Channel Dread's Dragon to strike with flame lightning infused towel bone. I want this. No, no. Spectacular. Give me 14 of them right now. Holy shit. They brought back the dragon transformation item. <laughs> Hell yeah. I could turn into a dragon. All right. Well, all done with that. Let's see what else this DLC has to offer. Hey, welcome back. We got more Elden Ring today. Last video was practically dedicated to just Bale and Egon. I did explore a little bit of the map so I could get stronger for the fight, but I avoided the main DLC story stuff because I wanted to beat Bale before anything else in the DLC. This boss was giving me so much trouble, and like Egon, I got obsessed with wanting to kill him. So besides exploring locations for Shadow Tree Fragments, I avoided all DLC stuff until I bested Bale. I did beat him, of course, but that was after I upgraded the Dragon Grey Katana and summoned Egon. 
Egon. These two things helped me turn the tide on Bale. Like, the fight was so much easier after I did these two things, I didn't even have to summon my Mimic. Egon didn't even do that much damage, but his support helped me lock in so hard, I was dodging so many of the attacks that I was having trouble with for like the last two days. I will be honest though, I was not expecting to do that much damage with that weapon. It shortened the fight by like so much time, but also leveling up the Shadow Tree fragments also worked wonders. Seriously, leveling up the fragments and overpowered weapons will mess these bosses up. Either way though, this fight was perfect. This is without a doubt the best dragon boss fight ever created next to Madeir in Dark Souls 3. I loved the fight so much that I went into seamless co-op and just kept replaying the boss fight over and over again until I got really good at it. I even fought him with the HUD turned off one time and it made the fight a thousand times more cinematic and fun. If you want to check it out, I actually posted it on my second channel if you want to see it. And man, shout out to Egon. He's probably my favorite NPC now from all of From Software. His time was short, but he made his mark by creating a new copy pasta for Twitch streamers and a new vocal stim for when I need to let out some anger. Curse you, Bale! Fun fact, for the guy who voiced Egon, it was actually his first ever voice acting role. So he had never done voice acting before, and with the amount of lines that he had, he could have gotten this done at home in like 30 minutes to an hour. But no, turns out bro was in the recording booth for 6 hours because Miyazaki wanted his lines to be as perfect as he could get them. Even the man right here saw the potential in this very obvious Moby Dick adaptation. It just shows how much passion they have for these games and how much work goes into these little things. Like voice acting for a side quest that you can easily miss. So yeah, yeah, Bill the Dread might just be my favorite boss fight of all time next to Slave Knight Gale because those are the only two boss fights that I can think of that are just beyond perfect in every way imaginable. But anyways, enough with all that. Let's see what the fuck else is happening in the Shadow Realm. Shadow Realm. <gasps> oh! <laughs> what the fuck are you? I hate it here. Everything's bigger. Everything can fly. This place sucks. I want to find all the secrets. Find all the secrets. There is another bear. I'd rather fight you than right now, Mr. Red, Red, Red Bear. Never fucking mind, I don't want to fight you. Uh, well, uh, at least this is open because uh, Mikola broke his great rune, so uh, let's, let's see what the hell is down here in this other secret part of the map. Whoa. What the hell? Literally just an underground area with a bunch of giant coffins. I abandon here my love. How do you do that? How do you just throw away the entire concept of love from your psyche? Oh, 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 oh. These guys are dangerous now. I don't need a sniper on me. I'm alive. I'm good. Uh, we're back again, everybody. Uh, why the fuck did I just sound like Courage the Cowardly Dog right there? We're good about those. Edge. Fair enough. Oh, what the? Ghost misbegotten? Use him, what? Hey! I get it. Just like Dark Souls 1. What the fuck is this? Holy shit, are they all sleeping? Shit, they're all sleeping. What the hell? Boss fight time? Boss, boss, boss fight time? Try holy damage. Oh, please grant me the courage to fly to your feet, my dearest. Sir Trina. Saint Trina. Jumping. Try jumping. Sing with me, sing for the year, sing for the memory, sing for the tear. Okay, now this is 110% Dark Eater Madeir territory, but uh, no dark ahead dragon, so no Dark Eater Madeir. Visions of Dark Dragon, so there is a dragon here. No. Oh, that ain't a dragon. That is not, that is nowhere near a dragon. What a weird weapon you got. It's like the same shape as a uh, Orphan Akasa's weapon. Ah, oh, yep, I knew it. Prud, um, Prudrescent Knight. I can't read. What was that message about using holy damage again? Oh yeah, this can work. <laughs> yeah, baby. Remembrance of Putrescent. Thank you, Sacred Relic Sword. I, I I always knew you would come in handy eventually. I always knew you would come in handy eventually besides just farming runes. Hello? Are you Mikola's love? In what? Well, let's just see what happens. <laughs> La 
that it? I guess I'll figure this out later. Maybe it's tied to a side quest or something. Uh, the fuck? Huh? I guess I now got a gateway to the Black Void of Elden Ring. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Alright, let's continue the main quest line and get to Snake Dude Bro Boss Fight. It should be pretty easy to get to him from this point on. Okay. Ar Kill me now. Oh, hey, look what I found, little fucker. Don't even try to sneak up on me because it's not gonna work no matter how hard you try. Munchkins, man. Oh, okay. Never mind, you got me. Hey, Anne's back. What up, bro? There was one thought I could not dislodge from my mind. After Lord Moke's slain at his dynastic palace, it appears his body has been absconded with and taken straight to kind Mikola. Excuse Surely me? You... Wait, what the fuck? What does Mikola want with Moke's vows. body? What I'd do the anything. Hell? What could they possibly have in mind for Lord Moog's remains? The implications are rather. Uh, Mikola sounding pretty sus right now. What the? What the hell does he want with Moog's body? I thought he was the weirdo. Okay. 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 I, I, I'm not trying to fight you right now. I wouldn't want to fight me neither. Beast claws for the fucking win. Stupid fucking. Bitch. Of course, to get around this area, you gotta climb on a giant pair of feet. Oh! You messed with the wrong tarnished, you mess mirror fanboy. Oh, come on! That. Okay. Fight like a fucking person! Don't be doing ranged attacks the entire time, you fucking pussy! Get the fuck back! I'm doing better now. Fucking bat! Beast Claw for the win! Are you fucked? Word, okay. I wish you fell off the ledge, you bitch. Ah! Now I'm see now I'm starting to see why the the mixed reviews are popping up on Steam. What if I use Mogwin's Great Spear to like just bleed out all the enemies from behind the corners and stuff? I will knee heal even the bats. <laughs> <laughs> yes! <laughs> I gotta be careful though, because there is an NPC around the area and I gotta make sure I don't get them. Kneeheel! Kneeheel! Motherfucker. Man, what what type of place are you guarding? Ah! You're a fucker. Oh shit, fuck, I am falling asleep like crazy. Sorry you guys, I'm not epileptic. Nihil! <laughs> Get knocked on your ass. Nihil! Oh. Uh, I think I know who this is. I think I have a pretty clear idea of who this is. And you know what? I'm gonna put him off for later. I'm gonna go talk to Ansbach. What's this? As if using Lord Moog to gain entrance to the Land of Shadow were not enough, he plans to use his corpse as the vessel of his king consort. What? He has the actual fuck? So Mikola's just desecrating Moog's corpse. Only... What the hell? Well, well, well. It seems little Mikola had a plan of his own and just, you know, decided to infatuate Moog and take his corpse once he was killed off. So he could use him for his weird godlike rituals. Jesus goddamn Christ, this is all fucked up. This disastrous, treacherous twink. <gasps> coffin, coffin, right? Let's go. Rest in the coffin. Yes, I shall rest in the coffin. Put him in a coffin. All right. Um, where did I, where did I end up at? Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to you. Ah! Oh no! Oh crap! Oh crap! Wait, no! No, I didn't have to. Wait, no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, it's the first time for that. Oh, that's gonna be a funny-looking blood stain. Fucking bugs. Okay, yeah, just, just eat me. Motherfucker! Why? Can you fuck off? They just fucking grab you all the goddamn time. I never do this, but how about I set a message? <laughs> Try suffering. Oh shit! I made it to Louisiana. Ah, oh, but seriously, the fuck is this place? This is horrifying. Oh, what the fuck? The spectral steed is frightened and cannot be summoned. I want to go home and then edge, of course. Turn back. 
while you are yet able. Abyssal Woods. They really uh, are hyping up the horror surrounding this area right now, okay? Don't let it see you. Once you are seen, there is no escape. It cannot even be touched. Fuck are they talking about? What is over here? What is it, this guy? And we are good. We got everything. I gotta say, that was fun trying to figure out how to get around this map. Uh, what? Is that a fucking winter lantern? That looks like a winter lantern from Bloodborne. So you can't kill it? Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh my god! What the fuck is this? What is this? I'm good. I'm good, man. I'm good. You don't- you don't need me. You don't need me. You don't need me. What the fuck? This is the thing that scared the shit out of my horse. We do not have to call each other out. We do not have to cause any problems. <laughs> Oh! Can't remember a time there was a From Software game that had a sneaking section this egregious. I mean, that wasn't too hard to sneak around, but I want to learn if I can kill those guys. Well, damn. This is not what the place looked like on Airbnb.com. Oh my god, that's creepy. Could this be a bird? Time for pickle. Off for rump. Be wary of Lord. Lord of what? Excuse me, pardon me, pardon me, excuse me, excuse me, pardon me, pardon me, excuse me, excuse me, pardon me, pardon me, pardon me. I'm not here. I'm not here. Oh, you son of a bitch. Why do these guys just eat? They just chomp, 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 chomp. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. We're good. And they can't climb ladders, so we're good. <laughs> oh! I'm out of here. I beg you stop. Haven't I taken enough? Are we not brethren? Common in our line? And yet, you offer only cruelty. I ask, what crime did Great Midra commit? We got another long boss buildup. Who the hell is this gonna be? Sounding. Oh, I guess someone finally came home to Edge. Oh, okay, I was wrong. That wasn't pleasure. That was unbridled pain. You good, my guy? I'm coming in. I don't. I don't want there to be any. Uh, I don't want there to be any any secret funny business. The depths of your foolishness. <laughs> <laughs> you look stupid. Bye bye. Enough. I have endured more than enough. Hey yo! Hey, hey, dude. I I don't know if you should pull on that. That's uh, that's lodged in there pretty deep. Hey. Pop it. Twist it. Pull it. Damn, man. The fuck happened to you to get you in this position? Oh. Oh, that explains it. I will burn this planet down. Queen America, save me. I'm gonna fucking die, am I? Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. <laughs> okay, he flew. Okay, he can fly. They fly now? Oh! That was two hits. That was- I died in two hits. Oh, hey, calm down, Midra. Calm down. Whoa! That's already one third of the health bar. God, I love how Bloodborne this boss and this entire area feels. This is this is awesome. We got Bloodborne on PC at home, everybody. Here we go. Here it is. Oh, what is he doing? Gonna catch me right dirty. Does every boss just have a nuke in their pocket? Are you fucking serious? And that's why I didn't want him to grab me. Jump attack! Jump attack! Jump attack! <laughs> I, I want to apologize. You're out of the sky. I apologize for my outburst. Woo! Yeah, get fucked! Get fucked! I'm gonna do what's called a pro gamer move. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Uh, third try, I think. Was that a second try? I don't know. What the hell? All right then, Lord of Frenzied Flame, beat. That easy. I mean, I am using two flame burge with bleed and frost proc, and also I was using my mimic, but I mean, come on, I, 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 yeah, fuck it, I can't deny it. I'm basically playing on easy mode right now. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, that shit looks sick. I think I know where I can use this. What's up, fucko? You are giving me some trouble earlier. Stop! 
Still alive, huh? I'll just do it again! <laughs> oh, I love this. I can't wait to use this in PvP. By the way, I just looked it up. The Winter Lanterns in the Abyss Woods, there actually is a way to kill them. You just have to parry them and they'll be completely vulnerable. By the way, yes, I did look it up. They're actually called Winter Lanterns. Like, there's, they didn't, they're not even hiding it. Sony, can you just give Miyazaki the rights to Bloodborne again? Like, you guys are being so stingy for no reason. Hey, buddy, uh, can I get that buckler shield from you? Hey, what's up, bitch? You remember me? <laughs> yes, yes. Oh, I got it. Yep, that's right. Fucking suck it. And there we go. Got the talisman. I find it so funny because if you never learned how to parry, these enemies are like the scariest ones you'll ever encounter. But if you know how to parry, these guys are weak as shit. God damn, but I'm so glad I finally got down to this area and I was able to collect all the map pieces. I'm actually pretty fond of this area. It reminds me of the Forbidden Woods back in Bloodborne. Anyways, uh, let's see what else I can find in this DLC. Missed. I don't want to do this no more. <laughs> Dumbass. If only I had a shortcut. I swear, if that message does not get found, I'll be so upset. That's a big fish. Bro, come on. Knee heel, knee heel, knee heel. Oh. Got it. Oh! And I died. I mean, I was... I was gonna happen. Wow, they really did a good job at making this feel like classic souls where like uh you have to be very careful of your surroundings. Run on tight spaces and ledges and making sure you aren't getting caught in the corners of enemies. Oh nah, this is definitely Dark Souls 3. By the way, since it's come to light that Mikola actually brainwashed Moog, I feel obligated to use Moog's weapon a lot more now. Hush little baby, don't say a word. I'm gonna fuck you up and make sure you burn. What a three. Knee heel. Knee heel. Knee heel. No matter how many times I tried to nerf this weapon, it's still S tier. Oh! Oh shit! Ah, damn it. Fuck. Uh, I wasn't watching my behind. Oh, and neither. <laughs> they also fell to their death as well. That's funny. Long elevator ride. This looks a little unsafe. Oh yeah, that, that's boss music. Commander Gaius. Hold on, I got a, I got a funky idea. Owie. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey, watch it. I'm trying to cheese you. Are you following all this mob? This requires some serious hand-eye coordination. Oh, well, looks like someone got unstuck. How the fuck did I dodge that? Alright then, what's next? Oh my god, if anybody in the Souls community watches this video back, they are gonna hate me. That is the first time I ever ran into that boss, and I just... I just cheesed the absolute shit out of him. I did not see uh, any of his movesets. And the big move that he did do, I didn't get hit by it. I dodged right in time, and then I just... All right, then. Let's keep going. <laughs> okay, so what do I do about this? Uh, what do I do? Try gesturing. Oh! I feel bonita. May you open up, please? Oh, mother, open for me. Thank you. Whoa. Oh my god, this place is genuinely beautiful. It's like I just stepped inside of a dream. Hey! Oh god, I almost didn't see you for a second. Unironically, I'm actually okay with them repeating the Tree Sentinel boss fight. I kind of miss them. It's It's uh, been a while. With that being said, I am not fighting the second one right now. I refuse. Minor Ur Tree. Continuously heals allies in the area. Oh no, this place is like a dream. Where's a grave site then? Like it feels barren. Oh. Okay, what is this place? Man, I am enamored. This might be the best game I've ever played.
There's nothing here. There's no enemies. There's no boss. There's nothing. The flowers, the music, and the views. Okay, let's go. Is this uh what I think it is? I swear, if this is a fallen star beast, I'm gonna I'm just gonna turn the other way. Oh god, now fuck this. What's up with this place, dude? What's up with all the fucking fingers? The finger ruins of Dale. Oh, son of a bitch. Hi there. What the fuck are you? Worms. Oh, come on. Why do you keep falling out of the sky? And drain the water, baby. Dark Souls 1. Dark Souls 1. <laughs> yes, blow him closer. I think I found the Fingy's headquarters. What are these areas? Hands and worms, worms and hands. I really like how the fingers all look like the giant fungi from the prehistoric period. I don't know what they're called. They have like a specific name. Uh, pro, 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 Prototaxites. <laughs> God, that was hard to say. I don't know what to do. Our mother abandoned her brood. Must we be sad forever? Hold on, I'm gonna look this up. I need to figure out what's what's best for more. Elden Ring, Moore's Quest. Okay, so if I choose uh, put it behind you, he basically is, you know, he's not depressed anymore and he goes on to live his life. But then eventually I get to a boss fight where I guess he is summoned for that boss fight and I have to fight him. But if I choose remain sad forever, he's not a part of the boss fight and I could get his armor and shield. So uh, yeah, I think I know what I'm going to choose. Yeah, remain sad forever. Sad forever. Sad forever and ever. Hello, darkness. See you later, dude. I can't wait to get your armor when you're slumped over a rod enemy. Well, now I feel kind of bad because he actually seemed kind of sweet. Uh oh, oh shit, oh shit. Prattling Pat, lamination. <laughs> That's funny. What the hell is this? Is it a death blight poison swamp? What is this? It looks like a boss arena. It, it might be a boss arena now that I think about it. It uh, it just looks like a giant sunflower. By the way, uh, that song fucking sucks. You know, Sunflower by Sway Lee, Post Malone. It's freaking trash. Okay, right now I'm practically a glorified gardener just trying to get rid of this rotten plant. Holy shit. Holy shit. I like it, could you? Oh my god, hey. Hey, no, that's fucked up. Hey, plants aren't supposed to do that. Oh, God, no. That move doesn't do a lot of damage, shithead. Alright, that should be it, right? Hmm. Clever. A third phase. No different than the last one. Get the fuck out of here. I don't need no rotten plants fucking up my mojo. Nicholas Great Rune. Or I guess a shard of it from what it looks like. Time for dung. <laughs> Alright, next on the list is the Tolier quest line. You know, this pathetic little shit right here. We'll see what he needs or what he wants. I'm feeling rather lost. Haunted by memories of St. Trina. Her visage. Send the Jesus fucking Christ, dude. I would sacrifice everything just to gaze upon her one last time. Okay, so Tolier is basically a tier three subscriber to Saint Trina. Understandable. Okay, so now I go back to Saint Trina and then I meet Tolier there. Hey, simp boy, where you at? Oh, hello. You mustn't follow my example. Saint Trina's poison would plunge you into an eternal slumber. It must be me and only. Me. You have no idea what I've been doing the past few minutes here. If you should utter these cruel untruths to me again, I, I won't be held responsible for my actions. Hey man, alright, Saint Trina talk to me first. Don't be acting like you're so special, okay? Get the fuck over no. yourself, you whiny little fucking I bitch boy. I will never forgive you. Oh, Be what? Oh. Anyway, suck my dick. Nope, 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 nope. Me, 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 me. Whatever. Unironically, though, he is less pathetic than Mordecai. Oh, fuck. Did Centrina sit here? <laughs> oh. No, shalt not oh, what the fuck? You again? Oh, well, it's not like you're not gonna die instantly. How could this be? 
be. Because you're a bitch. Forsake me. <laughs> Who cares? Should have been better at the game. Aw, oh, bro died. Anyways, thanks for the armor. Cathedral of Manus... Ma how do you say that word? Okay, what's this place supposed to be about? What the fuck? Where the fuck am I? Whoa, whoa, this, this is a room. And that right there is a boss. Hello, what are you? Met, Metria, Metria. Hey pal, you just blowing from stupid town? Mother of fingers, I am never gonna figure out how to pronounce these names the very first time I read them. I don't know what you are. I'm just gonna call you big blobby thing. Mother of fingers. Come here, big blobby thing. Um, finger do, finger mother. Fingering mother. That's just all this boss is. It's just a giant mass of fingers. It's just fingers. Oh, nasty. Oh, nasty. There's just hands everywhere now. Uh oh. 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 Oh, whoa. That is so cool. She activated a fucking hollow purple. What are you doing now? What the hell? What the hell? What the hell is this? Boss, these moves are weird and wacky. Kill Shiva. What the fuck? What the hell am I even looking at? That is a really cool arena, but my god, that boss is gross looking. What the fuck, the big three? It's just big me. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of damage. There we go. Oh, thought I was gonna die to that. All right. What have you done? Huh? You've wounded Count Emir most. You want to try? Okay. <laughs> Look here at my fingers. You, you count your mere mother of fingers. Oh, gross! He just spawns multiple hands and fingers. Mother of fingers. <laughs> Fucking fingers. <laughs> Bro was the mother that stepped up. Sacrifice butthole. Try piercing butthole. Rump destruction! <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, messy, messy, mess mirror. I'm coming to mess you up, mirror. Mess, mess, mirror. I'm here to mess you up, mirror. <laughs> there we go. Ooh, ominous. Mongrel intruder. Okay, rude. Where are you, buddy? Oh, that tarnished, it Can you back up out of my face, bro? A little too close for comfort. Those stripped of the grace of gold shall all meet death. Give it your best shot, little boy. In the embrace of the essence. Show me what you got. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Look at him fucking posing after that. Well, that, that is mess mirror, all right. He's definitely gonna mess me up, mirror. Ha <laughs> ha! Get over here! <laughs> okay! I get it! You're, you're, you're cracked out! Can I get some uppies? Uppies? Okay, that, yeah, there it goes. You're a prick, you know that? What? Already second phase? Okay. I will not suffer. No mother, forgive me. Ooh, I'm about to crash out! Ooh, I'm about to crash out! Ooh, I'm about to crash out! Drama queen! <laughs> whoop, whoop. Here I come. Berserk reference. Soon tarnished. <laughs> His snake looks Wait, so cute. Look at that. Take me in the jaw. Do you think maybe this is what he did when he was a kid anytime he got bullied for his snake? That is fucking cool. Oh! That came directly at the camera. I could not see where the snake went. Okay, well, he got me. Yep. Go, my mimic. You got this. Never mind. Hey, dude, uh, you, you, uh, you having a lot of fun with those snake attacks, are you? Uh, could you, uh, could you stop them? First, for just a second, please. Could you stop them? Oh my god, it's like Megumi's snake. Take me in the jaws. Ow, you bastard. Calm your snake. 
Jesus fucking Christ! Dude, he wouldn't stop with the snake! Okay, fuck it. Who's the summon here? Ah, ah. Oh. Hell yeah, dude. Love the passion. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, Horsenet. We, 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 we. I survived that whole onslaught. Watch out, watch out. I got it. Oh, it's okay. I'll get it. No way. We'll use the power of friendship. And. Boopa! Get fucked. Boy, hell yeah. Of course, of course, the moment I bring in a third guy, it just completely turns the tide. I was expecting to be here for like a little bit, but when I, you bring out the third summon, you're cracked out beyond repair. All right, we got uh, two more areas to explore, and then I believe we will be done. I'm a bear. Oh, thank God. I'm finally safe. I hate you, Miyazaki. <laughs> Okay, so I gotta get the lightning perfume bottle and the rolling spark sash of war, got it. I may not be able to collect all the weapons in the DLC right now, but I'm gonna try to find the ones that I've been wanting to collect for a minute. Hello, madam. Count email the stars, the sky, I see them not. Thank God I looked this up beforehand. Give me that katana. No light anywhere at all. It's dark. <laughs> uh, shit. Uh, okay, cool. Hell yeah. Sword of Night. Yeah, katana. Hell yeah. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, this is good. This is a really good katana. With that being said, I don't think I'm ever gonna use it, sorry. <laughs> no, no way, that's the heavy attack? Uh, you can throw it. And Mesmere's Assault. <laughs> oh god, this is gonna hurt every PvP player in existence. That is insane. Oh, all right, and goodbye. <laughs> big weapons, big weapons. Sorry, sorry. A lot of you probably don't even know what the hell I'm even referencing, but my God, just don't, don't look it up. Oh my goodness! I think I got him. I think I got him. Enemy felled. Yeah, that was pretty easy. Okay. Oh! I am the storm that is a pro. Suck my dick! Oh! Oh, son of a bitch! Okay. Oh, that's a boss! <laughs> oh, what the heck? He's got a frog tongue? <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh! Oh, oh. oh no! Come on! Dark Souls 2! Dark Souls 2! Oh, cool. We opened it. Oh, okay. Pff, Smithing Stone 7. Why? Why, man? Why? Why Smithing Stones? Were people just not that prepared for the DLC? Oh god, oh god. <laughs> Behold, Dark Souls 2. Oh my god. <laughs> what the hell? It covers the entire bridge. 
Oh, 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 You son of a bitch! Why is it always lover? I don't know. Why is it always lover? No cutscene? Okay. Oh, it's a centipede! Oh, it's like a dance, baby. Oh, wow. That is so cool. That is so cool! Oh my god, that is awesome. This is a very pretty boss fight. I wish there was a cutscene for her, though. She seems like a little bit more important than they make it out to be. I'm Coyote Peterson, and I'm about to be bitten by the giant desert centipede. Oh no, well, I got grabbed. Okay, uh, that's that's actually a pretty doable fight, but I was I was definitely uh, being overzealous with uh, Mesmer's spear. Curse you, Bale! Oh wait, no, that's Romina. Curse you, Romina! Well, I mean, like she is cursed with the Scarlet Rod, so there's that. Second try. Remembrance of the Saint of the Bud. That was a pretty that was a pretty cool fight. Maybe it would have been harder if I didn't use my summon, but who cares? That was awesome. That was a really fun fight still. My mimic is my best friend, man. We do everything together. Do it. Do it. Fuck guys, help me. I was playing with a box of matches and I set the tree on fire. Whoa, holy shit. That is, that is incredible. Do I have to climb all the way up there? Is that, is that what I'm doing? Is that, am I just going for a climb? Why is there a summoning pool right here? What the heck? What? Another one? Another Another one? Since when the hell? Okay. I was, I was. What? <laughs> I, I can't I can't believe I was not prepared for that mr. President a second dancing lion has attacked the Elden Ring I did not know there would be like two of these guys here. This is crazy death blight. Oh, no, 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 no Oh, no, no, not the frogs not the frogs. No, no This boss fight rocks though. I love the music for this. I love his crazy ass moveset Like this is one of my favorite bosses of the DLC Yeah Nice. Okay, I think I'm ready to get to the end of the DLC. Ooh, look at this pretty place. It's all golden and sparkly and shiny. It's, uh, it feels like, it, you know, fake. I don't like it. Speaking of, ow, asshole. I know this is supposed to be a legacy dungeon, but I wish I could ride Torn around, because it's just, it's just so vast. Help, 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 help. Ah, rain. Okay. 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 All right. Okay. Okay. I get. I get the picture. I should do the sound effects for all enemies. I can't dodge that. I can't dodge that! I can't dodge that! Why'd that fight give me a bit of deja vu? Running on rooftops! Just like Dark Souls 3. I've made so many comparisons to Dark Souls 3. It's it's unhealthy. I love that game too much. In quite some time. It was never kindly Mikula, was it? The Earth Tree was leading you all along. Bitch, are you dumb? Pardon me? Are you dumb? I think she's I dumb. I think she's dumb. I think she's dumb. I think are you dumb. To begin with. Like, medically speaking. I suppose it are you like... What his like, I'm not trying to be mean. Like, are you dumb? Are you dumb? I think she's dumb. I think she's dumb. I think she's dumb. Then I will run you through whoever you might be. Don't tarry now. Wait, what's up? This cooperator will not arrive until the time is right. Be summoned to challenge Needle Knight Lita and her allies. Oh, okay. Okay. So just do that. Do that, and we do this. Don't you dare approach Mikula the kind. Fuck you and your femboy fan club. All right, sure, whatever. Oh, you bitch! Fuck you, dude. Fuck you. What the hell? Why do you have what? Sneak attack! Ah! Fuck. These guys mean business. Hey, hold on, hold on. See, now this is why I did his side quest. Even though I didn't know this was gonna happen, but I'm glad he's here. Hell yeah! 
Another cooperator! I will not be in this fight alone! Oh shit! They jumping me! They jumping me! Save your boy! Oh shit, I guess uh, Leda got killed and Dryleaf Dane was the last one. That's funny. Woo! Hell yeah, that was awesome. That was that was really dope. I like that a lot. Frazier's great sword and her armor. Nice, 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 nice. Dane's footwork. Oh, what? Oh, oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah, another hand-to-hand -hand weapon. Leda's armor, hell yeah. I have collected all of the necessary drip. I feel accomplished. Righteous tarnished. That was an astounding battle, to be sure. Oh, I could tell him I killed Moog. See what his reaction is. Oh, something you want to get off your chest? It was you, wasn't it, who defeated Lord Moog? Unfortunately, I'm sorry. I bear no grudge against you. His eminence was felled in an honorable duel. What right have I to complain? I blame the enchantment more than anything. God, this guy is so cool. He's a ride or die homie in this DLC. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I'm I'm nervous as all hell. I, I know I'm I'm gonna summon. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do this solo. Okay, I'm not trying to prove myself to anything. Like, look at, I got two whole two whole people to help me out here. This is a PSA. Do not summon Tolier. I repeat, do not summon Tolier. He fucking sucks in this fight. Let's pray to God. My loyal blade and champion of the festival. Both your deeds will ever be praised in song. <laughs> oh, he's danced up right now, and he's looking put together. I'm I'm scared Hey gang am I cooked am I cooked or nah? Yeah, I might be cooked Hey, you know what it was good being alive it was fun living for a little bit, but you know, things happen. <laughs> Excuse me, brother. Let's just watch his move set. Oh my fucking what the? <laughs> bit like wood. Prime Radon. Prime Radon, but he's using Moog's body. Come on. Come on, motherfucker. Oh my god, second phase already? Are you serious? No, 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 man, no. No, man. What's about to happen? Well, what's about to happen? Lord brother. At long last, you are returned. Well, look who finally decided to show the fuck up. Tarnished one. Aspiring lord of the old order. If you have known sin, if you grieve for this world. Oh shit! Lothric's Prince, Dark Souls 3 reference! To I, Nicola, and my promised consort, Radan. This despicable freaking twink! Is that supposed to scare me? Come on, you think that's the end of it? You think that's the end of me? This is gonna be one hell of a fight, I'll tell you that much. That was awesome though. That was really cool. I I knew I was gonna die. I knew I was gonna die just from the way that went about, but you know. Also, I don't know what Tolier's problem is. He didn't even come inside the boss room last time. Either he's glitched or he's just a pussy, but you know what? All he's gonna do is throw his little poison mist around, so I don't even think I should summon him anymore. Fuck that frost! They heard people complain about um, Radon being nerfed and decided to just make Prime Radon a real thing. Yeah, that wasn't going well. Thrally, you finally came inside, you stupid dumbass. Uh, third time's a charm? Excuse me, my brother, would you like to talk about your car's warranty? Oh, lordy! Lordy, lordy, lordy! I guess this is how Radon fights without Leonard. Why are you so scared? Why? I'm gonna take off that Rock Sasha armor. It does. It's not worth the 20% more damage. Oh, right away. Have fun. Too early. What the fuck? Why do birds suddenly appear? Oh! How do you even dodge? 
How do you dodge that? Looking like a double wide surprise. No, 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 Thrally, you got Mikola, Mikola the Tickola. Mikola the Tickola is dangerous. Oh, no, I got Mikolud. Oh, it stinks. Nice and good. Get away from me, you diddy disciple. What the hell? Why, why'd you have to do that? I don't know. Where'd he go? Oh, fuck you. Oh, fuck you. How? I just got murked. God, that was such a good run, too. If I if I knew what the hell was coming, I would have actually beaten him. But, hey, you know what? It, it's the final boss, so I, it could take me as many times as, as I want. I don't think I'm going to get too mad, really. Lies! The filthy earth boy lies! He has fire attacks! Since when? Oh, that's right, Mo. But those are me. They do not belong to you, Radon. I'm sorry. Okay, hold on. I want to play around with more weapons. Um, I heard the Blood Fiend's arm is a really good weapon. And I mean, well, not- I more than just heard it. I saw Kai Sinet beat the final boss with it. So, I mean, like, it, it has to be good in some capacity. I can't- the hell? What the fuck? Can I get a chance? Oh, that's why the, you- okay, that's why you do a charged heavy attack. Hey, yo, where's the nuke? Where's the nuke? Where's the nuke? Are you son of a bitch? He's fucking kidding me. Throw the air! I don't care. We do not care. Oh my fucking god! What the hell? Ah, uh, damn it. Jeez. How do you miss that? I won't miss. Ah, oh, well. back and forth like who's next huh curse you radon i hereby vow you will rue this day oh god no he's on me he's on me he's on me get away from me you psychopath i take back everything i said about bale bale is like a puppy compared to this guy you motherfucker why are you on me this this is a scary fight, you guys. I uh, was not I was not prepared. I was like, ah, I, I think I can do it. This seems like a pretty a pretty easy boss with telegraphed attacks. No, no. Radon literally has like AoE after AoE after AoE after AoE. You fucker! Hey! <laughs> okay, I'm glad I did that then. I'm not glad I did that. Okay. What? Give me a break! I didn't even touch him, and he just attacked me like he was a freaking pit bull, and I was a toddler. I tried to dodge inward like a dumbass, but I how? What the? F Are you fucking serious? Fuck you, dude. Fuck. Fuck. No. 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 I didn't even fucking chance. Oh crap, I got I got a little greedy there, I'm not gonna lie. Are you serious? You go into second phase after I die just to fuck with me? <laughs> he just won't leave me alone! He won't leave me alone! Fuck this, I'm cheating. Rolling Sparks Ash of Ore from the Perfume Bottles is the best Ash of Ore in the entire game. If you throw it at the ground, all those explosions are going to happen at the exact same spot. And the result is what you see on screen right now. We're just entering one-shot territory. Like, this thing is just beyond broken. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> it burns! Get the fuck out of here. All right, got him. <laughs> Fuck you, Mikola. Fuck you, Mikola. <laughs> Mikola the Tickola. Let us go together. Well, you're dead now, so, you know, fuck you. Man, now I want to do that again. I want to do that again. That was sick. Okay, but, uh, what's this? I come before you today humbled and humiliated to ask you for one thing. Promise me you'll be my consort. 
Um, sorry buddy, I kind of messed up your plans right there. Well, that's all over and done with. Those perfume bottles fucked them up. Earlier, you're cool or whatever, but you suck at combat. Why is man's mask? Rest in peace. Ooh! Furious blade of Anne's back. Oh, I'm so happy I did the side quest. Oh, I'm so happy I did the side quest. Oh, I'm so happy I did the side quest. All right, now I'm curious. I want to use this against the final boss. Oh my god! Bye bye. <laughs> Come on, torrent! Let's ride! Oh god. Bye bye. <laughs> oh, this build is so broken. Oh my god, I uh, this is 100% gonna get patched. So <laughs> I'm gonna use it as much as I can. You know what? No, I'm sorry, everybody. I should have fought him fair and square. These broken builds are terrible. Nobody should use them. In fact, if you actually beat Radon like this, you should feel bad. You should actually delete your game file and never touch any like Souls-like game ever again. I could have beaten him like Kai using the Blood Fiend's arm, but I just decided to just cheese my way through it and use the Rolling Sparks Ash of War. And with that, I am sorry. So you know what? From this point on, I shall never use any other cheese or exploits in a FromSoft game to beat a boss ever again. Fuck you, I'm lying. <laughs> Suck my dick! Well, this is definitely gonna be patched in about a couple of days. All right, I know, I'm sorry for cheating, but I couldn't hold back. I was getting really tired of fighting and I just wanted to finish the DLC, so I used a perfume build and gave them a free sample of death by electrical damage. <laughs> I mean, I had a lot of fun doing the exploit. I thought it was pretty cool. Seeing the health bar get deleted in one second, it makes me feel like a god. But of course, it's gone now, so with it being patched, I thought to myself that this win right here doesn't count anymore since I beat him with an exploit that you can't do anymore. With it patched out, it doesn't do shit now, but that doesn't stop me from finding the right build for me to beat him fair and square. I mean, as fair as it can be, I still am gonna use the Mimic tier in a bleed build, but fuck it, it's in the game, so why not? So I got the Great Katana, added the Blood Tax, added these three talismen to help me with extra damage. Oh, and of course I got my mimic here because, you know, two is a company. A friend. While this is a good build, I did get lucky at the end of the fight. It was right here where me and my Mimic at the exact same time hit a blood tax and we bled Radon out in a second flat. But I won't lie, after this, I still wasn't satisfied. I don't care that I was using a bleed build, it's just one of many busted builds in Elden Ring, but I wanted to win solo at least. So to prove that I'm actually good at this game, I got two scavenger curved swords, did some jumping attacks, and then boom, I got him down solo. It's definitely a tough challenge, but you know what? Once you actually learn his movesets, it can be a lot of fun dodging those at the right time. I still fucking hate this attack though, there's just too much to look at. Also, this attack right here is Pontiff Sullivan's. Basically just validating my opinion more that Dark Souls 3 is peak. Anyways, yeah, that's the end of the DLC playthrough for me. God damn, what an experience. This DLC is incredible. While it may have some rough spots here and there, maybe some rewards aren't as extravagant and there are repeated bosses, it's still such an incredible expansion that it makes this game feel more whole than it ever was before. I still think the old Hunter's DLC is just a little bit better, but I think that's only because it's shorter and more consistent, but Shadow of the Earth Tree has some of my favorite bosses and weapons, so it wins in those categories. Favorite bosses for the DLC for me definitely have to go to Mitra, Mesmir, Dancing Lion, and Bale. I mean Bale. I'm kidding, it's Bale, I know. Bailey. I do like the NPC fights and side quests, but I do wish there was more TBH because when it comes to the lore, this game has a lot of lore to like cover and I feel like the DLC only covered like I think a little bit of it. Either way, I had a great time playing this DLC and I hope you had fun watching me fumble Boy. like an idiot for a little bit. Oh, come on! That... Oh, I'm curious on where From Software is gonna go next from here because they did say there are no more DLCs for this game, but let's just wait and see what happens next. You all take it easy and I hope you have a great day. You slowly turn it.